there. I come in to show you my pose for today and to show you just what I got. I got this die set here from Melina Crafts. Remember I got it to go with this candy cane die. It's to like make tags and things for your shelf and whatever. Right, I'm going to stick you up. My wee thing seems to be twisted. Let me see, that's it. Right, you should be cool there. Great. Right, I bought a fishing net die. It's a fishing net with a load of wee fishies as well. And I've got two bats. I think the bats were about 60 pence each. They definitely won their pound each anyway. And I got this bag here. Remember I got the feathers and the skulls. All these silver charms here. Let me show you. They ones, remember? The butterflies and things like that. And the seahorses. Well, I've got the chains in to go with them. I got 24 inch silver chains. Out you come. Well, there might be 22s, I think, now that I see it. Let me see, and this is not even a gold chain. What is here? I think they're 24s. Anyway, let me show you this. Remember I showed you these? I got these. Let me clear all this out of the way. Remember them? Remember I said you can use your enamels or whatever on them? Oh, there's one that I've already enameled. Can you see that? I hope it's cool. And the seahorses. I've still to lack of that. So I have. But there's the wee seahorses. And this is what it looked like. Just plain. Can you see that? I'll maybe lift you down till you see this. Do you see them? There. That same lacquer, as I, eh, sorry, as I said, that same coloured, I just have to lacquer them now to seal it. So I'll do some more another day. I'm not going to bother putting all them in just now because it will just rustle, rustle, rustle. Right, I've done some bag toppers. You see that one there? Why is my camera a bit hazy today? That's better. Right, there you are. That was this die here. It's like the top note die. It's a stitch die. And it was the... These ones were done using the biggest die. And this one was done using the third die in the set. As you can see there, it wraps over the top, stapled on, and then I've put some toppers on the top. And that's just on the top of some of my bottle charms. See there, I've made some of the coloured ones as well. Again, simple wee thing. Just cut it out again. A couple of bats. And I leave them up a wee bit so that they're a bit dimensional with the word boo on it. And that's one of the cupcake things and a wooden heart. That I've done the wooden heart there as well. And you see them, that's the shakers. So again, and I, I kept to the kind of polka dots because there's a lot of dots and circles involved in these crafts. So... I thought that was quite ideal. I'm waiting on an, a Halloween.
paper pack coming in and once it comes in I'll confirm with you where I got it. There's another one that's two of the, the cupcake toppers. As you can see I've used the black card behind and a spotty paper on the top to go with the spotty cupcakes and then a spotty topper on the top of the bat wings again just a wee bit of dimension and the last one there is the same again top note die butterfly word spooky i've got some you know that netting the kind of muslin netting or spider's webs i think i'm going to put some of that on it and that's just a shaker with my wee topper on it that i made yeah they're all moving now there you go. So that's just a thing I've done on the toppers. So for the bit, I've made the tag, but this has not been bagged up properly. I just put it in the bag to save it getting messed up. I've made a double tag here. A tag within a tag. This was a white plain tag. I got them in um, the range a while ago. I hauled them in one of my videos a while ago. So I put black, well it's kind of graphite, on the background. A piece of the orange designer pad that I was using. That's one out of the pound shop I think actually. And then a topper that I had made myself. I'm sure she's a, she's a punch. I think she's this Martha Stewart punch. Let me see. Yes it is. That's a Martha Stewart punch that I use for her. So I've punched it out twice, I've done it in black and I've done it in silver. Excuse me. And layered it on top of the silver. The word spooky and a wee spider's web on the top. And this one that goes inside is just the white tag, the smaller size of that one. I've stamped out the Happy Halloween. Uh, raised it up and I popped it. Got some spider's web, a wee spider. Highlighted it with my white pen and it just fits in there. Like that, nicely. And I've put the ropes in the bag, but as I said, I need to get a bigger, bigger pokes. It's on my shopping list, there. I need to get some C6 bags. So yes, I did a busy wee couple of days. Just kept myself going. What are you all doing? Are you getting into the spirit? Are you enjoying the summer holidays with the children? I think we're going to try and get away fishing or something again for a couple of days. But we'll see. The weather's kind of gloomy here. Apparently it's to be roasting down south. Anyway, I'm gittering like a budget here. Have a nice day, folks. Happy crafting and I hope you get done what you want to do. I'm about to give a wee try out of these dies and the candy cane and I'll string some of these charms I think and I'll see you all again in the next video so like and subscribe please share the love tell your friends where I am and I'll see you all again soon right thanks bye